Are you having problems with your Sparkasa app not working and you want to be able to fix this? Well, then this video is going to be perfect for you because in this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on exactly how I myself was able to fix it. So basically what I did was that I firstly closed my Sparkasa app and instead I went into the settings app on my phone. So I just went into the settings app on my phone and as you can see, you should now be taken to a page very similar to this. Now on this page, we're just going to scroll down until you can see where it says general. So click on general and as you can see, you should now be taken to a page very similar to this. Also scroll down here and click on storage and just wait for this page to completely load. It might take you a couple of seconds to a couple of minutes, just so you know, it, it depends on how much memory that you currently use on your phone. But as you can see, now it's done. And when, when it's done to be able to do it quickly, you can just swipe up like this and search for spot in here and just click on it as you can see then on this page it's the most important now for this tutorial you're going to firstly click on upload app and once again click on upload app just wait a couple of seconds in here and just click on the blue button here again and just wait for your Sparkasse app to completely uh, up, update to the latest version because by doing this you will force the app to completely update to the absolute latest version. So do this and hopefully now this bug that the app is not working is going to be fixed with the new update. At least it fixed it for me so I hope that it's going to be able to fix it for you as well. 